Hey guys, it's Poon. Thank you for watching this episode. If you want to catch us live, we're over on twitch.tv slash poonmaster69 right now. Go there to join in on the action. In the meantime, enjoy this episode. We do get a 64 overall left end committed, so that's cool. Right? 12th all the way down to 20th. We don't have an unlock thing, so we can't get him. This guy goes to Tulane and Utah State picked up a guy, of course. Still ranked, so I guess, yeah, that is good, but... 44 overall. <laughs> oh, man. We had, yep, we did have a chance to be important. Oh, man. That's, that's rough. Yeah, we fall out of the top five for the Heisman after Thompson just had a terrible game because we didn't have the football ever. We get three more commits. We get locked out with another guy. In the recruiting battle with the other two, so... Not really anything that we can do recruiting wise. We've got a 7 and 5 Hawaii. We do make it to the uh, championship game and we get a rematch against a team that will to beat. Any love here in the Heisman? Nope. We're going to have to have a great game to get our boy to, uh, to New York. We still are supposed to be in Las Vegas, but against another Utah team. We're supposed to be decent next year and then just fall off the face of the earth. Down to 105 the year. After, that's what I wanted, was conference standings. In the Mountain Division, yeah, we, we had a pretty solid lead. Utah State here, the only team that we lost to, and hey, we got them bowl eligible. We were doing this for the good of the conference. In the West, man, that's a shit show. Nobody having a good season in the West. At all. Minus... Four on the turnover differentials, what they are. We were minus two that game, so we're down to two. They're going to pass on us. They're the sixth best passing team in the nation. We are the not a, we're top forty for uh, our pass defense, so we, we should be able to destroy these guys. And we're the the home alternates. <laughs> we shouldn't have a problem in this. Let's just fucking start loading in. Maybe we can be a little bit more focused since there won't be any snow. I believe we're playing in Savannah Stadium. All like 20,000 people. And we're just going to hope there's that winning this changes our bowl game caps because I don't want to have to play uh, Utah. We got slaughtered by a, a middling Pac-12 team last year in our bowl game. And supposedly, there's around 20,000 fans at this stadium. Are you ready for the Mountain West Conference Championship game? We're going to get the ball first, so Travis Thompson will be getting some handoffs. Let's make our adjustments and let's see if Kingsley Manning can put us in a good spot to start this game. Uh, yeah, definitely returnable, and it's where I like it on the field. Gene needs to give us a good block. And no flags. We're going to be past the 30. First to 10. Thompson gets three. But he's going to get a whole lot. Try a little read option here on second and seven. And, you know, I saw that they had that side of the line pretty stacked, but I still ran anyways. We're going to lose two yards, and it'll be third and nine. Yeet it. Uh, yeah, we'll yeet it with uh, the screen on third and nine. Give Thompson some receiving yards, and now we'll go for it on fourth. Eddie Vandermeulen is our pitch man, and he's not going to get it. Medley. Gosh, I wanted to slide down there because I'm afraid of him fumbling, but they able to get a nice little uh, first down there. Keep the drive alive. Oh, man. Every once in a while, we do something that isn't totally terrible. Hopefully, this game is one of those things. Ethan Lyrer, the backup running back slash fullback for the team, going to have a great carry there. 13 yards. Uh, Army. It's number 17, they were uh, number one or something. They were top five. So I guess they took a lock, loss and dropped all the way to, to 17. Uh, we will throw here. Let's go with a play action after this one. Thompson, try to stretch the play out. Too slow, though. We're only going to get a yard. Um, I like Garen Vincent, except I want him more on a slant. Not quite as deep. And Kingsley Manning. 
Let's get him on a fade route. We got two guys to look at here. And we'll, we'll huck it up in the end zone for Kingsley Manning. Can't come down with it. Not able to put it in the right spot. Although I'm sure that that was pretty, pretty close. 48 yard field goal? Fuck it. Should have boomed one. We got a little bit of wind with us. Oh, I didn't get full power though. Wind helps us though. That's our longest field goal of the season. So we'll take the points. Oh, well, we have a lead. Took us a while in the last game to get a lead and then we didn't hold it. But first to 10, they're gonna go to the air. We knew they would. Uh, is this still Cole McDonald? Yeah, it is. He's gonna take nine yards on us. I guess that means it's time for me to do what I used to do. I'm gonna put the uh, defensive tackle, the QB spy in rush three. Second and one, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, they go to the handoff. Um, and we're having a hard time tackling. This could be a problem. Hendricks, nothing doing. Oh my gosh, we are going to get decimated this game. If we're going to play like this. McDonald completes his first pass. Last time he dropped back, he ended up scrambling. And we literally have no answer. Guess I'll focus in on the running back because he's been doing stuff. But Cole McDonald has all the time in the world that he needs in the pocket. And when he hands it off, the, the holes are giant. Just have to get the defense on track. Maybe a pick would be nice, Boone. Gosh, we're just going to completely whiff there, but at least we only gave up two yards. And we have a third down, so we we'll hold them to three here. And it's a screen. Oh, my. How am I so late to react to that? Thankfully, we pull him down. It's a gain of nothing. So we hold Hawaii to their first field goal attempt, and they'll can it. Just go up and just snag it, snag it out of the air. You would hope that with our height, we'd be able to get to a, a field goal, but it's not happening. Let's see if Manning can get a better return this time out. Some decent blocks. Nice. So long as there's no flag, he's still in bounds on this near midfield. Got a little bit of the the stiff arm animation cheese. Read option on this first down. Medley get a few yards. We we gotta put a put together a touchdown drive. Thompson, ooh, nice move there. This is gonna be one of his longest plays of his career. 13 yards. I forgot about uh, the fact that my players are different grade levels or classes. <laughs> We're gonna go to the air again. Medley outside the pocket, wise open. And we'll hit Garen Vincent. Again, kind of a weird animation there as he stepped out of bounds. <laughs> but we'll get we'll get eight yards. 20 seconds left in the first quarter. Second and two inside the 10. We're going to give Thompson the ball and let him pick up the first and goal. Stop the clock. We'll get at least one more play in this quarter. We're going to play Alabama. Alabama is one of our yearly rivals, uh, unofficially, as we have held with them. We've played them twice now, three times played them twice um, we held with them in the first half for both games and then eventually just got blown away in the second half so we're, we're getting better progressively when that wind comes it'll be oh so sweet and it'll kick off our undefeated season Thompson up the middle we are gonna lose him because he's a senior and he's gonna get his 22nd rushing touchdown of the season most uh most rushing touchdowns in a career at the school and the Big Ten Championship game doesn't seem to matter. 19 versus 11, but it is Indiana. And this guy, <laughs> he's a little bit confused. First and 10. I'm going to see some passes eventually. A mile and a half behind my man. And gosh, all the time in the world for Cole McDonald to throw, and they're, they're already at midfield. But things are rough right now. So they go with a the draw, and finally we get a decent little stop there. Rush three. Just allow one guy to uh, have a chance to chase down McDonald if we get him out of the pocket. And we'll be using the defensive end. See if we can force something. They're going to go to the flat, find Freddie Hawley, and gain a yard. Want a blitz there. Somebody calling that Hendricks. Good pressure on McDonald, but he just sidesteps it. And then it's a coverage scout, or a coverage sack. He, he could have been out of there. We had the spy on him, but there's no way he shouldn't have been able to avoid that contact. Just watched it come and hit him. 
Jeff Bolt's got a, one hell of a backstory already. Kingsley Manning, can we reverse field or are we too slow? Gonna take a shot. Worth it for the 12 yards. Oh, Manning on the go. The snap off play action, and I'm gonna sit in the pocket for as long as I can. I don't see anybody. Just get rid of that one. Nothing that I feel comfortable throwing. A came open late, but there was no way that we were making that throw accurately. And Thompson, ooh, that would have been such a nice move if we could have got around the edge. Still eight yards for the man. We're gonna audible here. I don't like the way that the defense is set up. Don't want Medley taking a shot, so we'll just give it to Thompson up the middle. Oh, one trap. Favorite running play for a reason. Nice up the middle. Zach, you're, you're on defense. You don't get to make these calls. Thompson. Another good carry, but he just can't break him. One carry above 20 yards this season. He's always getting a decent amount. Oh! Oh! If, they, if those guys diving would have missed. It's his second carry above 20 yards on the season. If those guys diving would have just barely missed. That might have been six. Oh, man. I'm just going to tell you, Jeff Bolt's probably not going to be a great player. Uh, I don't think he's going to be incredible. Why is wide open Medley? Gosh, that was a slow, slow pass. But he gets us inside the five. Let's see what Thompson can do. Try to give him a 23rd touchdown of the season. He can't fall forward, but... Extending our lead here to 14 if we get in. Uh, listen, Tom, he's, he's a strong man. <laughs> the other guys get carries. Just not quite as many. <laughs> he already tried to leave us once. We had to convince him to stay and get his degree. So, like, obviously he knows he's smart, right? Hendrix, can we stop this run? No. You know, I, I come out expecting them to pass, and then, and then they put it on the ground and pick up eight yards. It's just demoralizing. Second and two. They're going to pass it again. All day for McDonald, and Blanks is way too soft of a cushion. Drake Stallworth going to hold on to it through the contact, but he was wide open, and McDonald has not had a miss yet through the year. Six is six. Not even throwing anything risky yet. Could be a problem. Kind of expecting Holly to continue to get the ball. Again, all the time in the world, he's now seven for seven. It's another seven yards. Still just sitting there. I'm just not not entirely sure what I want to do. We we played 25 just because it's the one that corresponds with this game. Um, oh my gosh, what a fucking run! So I've been saving some draft classes in case we do something with it, but nothing nothing crazy yet. Drake Stallworth again, 15 yards. We just can't stop these guys right now. Eight of eight passing for Cole McDonald. It's just not quick enough. And there, finally, we force him to throw one away. Go to the ground? No. Decent pressure again, but they've got a guy. Didn't even step out of bounds. He gets the, the first down. It's another 10 yards. <laughs> and yeah, absolutely averaging 10 yards per play, if not more. And well, that saves us a little bit. It's a false start. False start. On the offense, back him up a little bit. We don't have to blitz now. I think that whatever that when the crash thing happens, that took out the chat box. I think it also took out uh, the media share that I fixed. It was supposed to be in there. Second and goal. That's got to be picked, right? You can't throw it into three giant guys and not come up with the interception. Third and goal. This is to hold him to a field goal. All day, all day, all day. Man. Oh no. 10 of 12 for 100 yards and a touchdown. It's gonna be a seven point game. I believe they also get the ball to start the third quarter. So we've got a minute and 57 to march down the field and score. Oh, uh, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be time to just bring blitzes, I guess. And get beat deep. <laughs> Have Manning take this one out from the end zone. And, oh, that's a move. Pretty good return. Anything past the 25, we're, we're going to be happy with. Uh, I want Vincent a little bit further away from Bobo. I want Bobo to be kind of on his own. 
pulled the safety away, so he's got the one-on-one. -on -one. And Nehemiah, that ball was underthrown. Uh, late, or, you know, quick, quick drives like this don't typically work out well for us. I don't like anything about that. Oh, how am I going to get sacked, too? Bobo was coming open, too. Oh, that's brutal. Nehemiah Bobo gets that one. So thankfully we complete something. We're just going to be happy with any points. Thompson, ooh, that's a decent carry up the middle. We're going to hurry up here. Good nine and a half yards on that one. Slants. Oh, my God, I don't like anything here. Give it to Thompson. <laughs> The liar deep, he's the fullback. And this could be picked. No, Kingsley Manning. This is to uh, at least field goal range. It didn't seem to matter. And oh, I pitched that a little bit too early, but he's going to get a block. He's going to make a nice little move and a little showboat dive into the end zone. That was a nice touchdown. 38 seconds left in the half. We have uh, we have played two uh, two out of conference games against Big 12 teams, so it is possible. We're gonna go to the air, right? Plenty of time, all the timeouts. Oh, pick for Newberry, the All-American. Man, this could be more points for us. This snap it early. Oh, that's too far. That would be nice. Get that to the running back. Take a timeout. We've got a third and six. I think the quarterback and the running back took uh, pretty big shots there. Six seconds. So we're going to try to find somebody in the end zone here. Back corner. Oh, not even back corner. Manning. Ball's batted around. We can't We can't pull it in. Take the three off after the, uh, the pick. Cowboy. I don't know. We're doing a decent job. Just had an interception. Uh, it was Newberry, the, the All-American. Thompson has, I think, another touchdown carry. Good old UMass. We're going to run it here. I would not be surprised. No, they're not going to take a timeout. I'm going to take a timeout because I want them to uh, want them to throw the ball. I went the chance at another interception. <laughs> Second and seven. going to be a run again, isn't it? And try to force him to throw stuff up. Take more guys, mean dudes. Oh no, he's gonna. If they score on this, I'm gonna look like the biggest fool. One second left. Maybe now they throw up a hail mary. First oh, never foul. mind. Clipping. Maybe the, the starting roster. He got awfully close to breaking that one off. I feel like, and he's got to have the speed out run. Even our fastest uh, secondary player. We'll just give him the ball again and expect Cole McDonald to start throwing. You know, They've had way too much uh, success on the ground. I'm a computer. Uh, I do have, a, I actually do have a Wichita State team builder team downloaded right now. They're going to go five wide. And that was a designed run. Four yards out of it, but kind of interesting. Good old shockers. I think we were offside. Um, I think the the tackle next to me, as they're gonna fall. <laughs> what? They fumbled it right into his hands. It's gonna be an offside. They're gonna decline it. Offside. Defense. Yeah, it's there's a there's a solid amount of uh, guys streaming this game recently. I'm gonna go screen. Donald's gonna scramble. Oh my gosh, how am I? <laughs> oh man, all our stuff is dookie right now. A lot of different people streaming. And it seems like it's increasing every day. It really does. I saw a couple people that I didn't recognize on earlier today with uh, with Param Crow and, and not the expert streaming it. It brings a lot of, a lot of other people in. No pressure. Another man wide open. We just got we got nothing going on right now. <laughs> I said I was gonna blitz and then I got scared, so we didn't. And now we've given up a second and one at the goal line. 
Ah, son of a bitch. I mean, I, I started streaming it a little over a year ago, I think, and then, you know, a bit of a hiatus, but... What is he doing? Oh, man. Tallest guy in the world just lets the this, like, super short guy get in his way. <laughs> December sounds about right. I, unfortunately, I never saved any of the fucking, uh, any of the, what are they called? For the, uh, uh, important state ones. It's a real shame, because there's a lot of weird progression in those. Sat in the pocket for a while there. Not, not used to doing that, but we'll eventually find a guy for 7 yards and start running the ball here again. Up 10. Midway, a er, couple minutes into the third. Not quite midway. Give it to Thompson to let him just keep pounding the rock. Oh, he just absolutely decimated that corner. Definitely getting him above 100. Might get him a little bit higher than that, depending on how tired he seems in a little bit. Late pitch here to Kingsley Manning, who I think already has one of these taken for a touchdown, but he gets 13 more yards. Everything that you're putting everybody through feels like a lot, a lot more than two weeks. <laughs> Only four yards there for Thompson. Thompson? Can turn that into anything? No, just three yards. And that, there was a couple of really interesting uh, plays on that stream. The, the whole like uh, kick six thing. Every once in a while, when, I, when I, I'm feeling down, I need to be able to watch Benjamin Medley just juke out a guy and then back juke two more and then go into the end zone with a guy on his back. Thompson, ooh, let's move there. He's over 100 yards, I know that. Hand it off real quick while things are loading. Thompson's got the first down a little bit more. Oh, beautiful. I think it's time in this game for us to go to the conservative tempo because... <laughs> Like our defense can't seem to stop Hawaii, so we might as well give their offense less time to, to run around on the field. Lyra going to get in for a touchdown. Stealing it from Thompson, so, you know, not good for our, our Heisman hopeful. Uh, not in this dynasty, Zach, but we've had hey, you guys. There was, uh, I think, Oss might have won the Heisman, and I think Billings probably won the Heisman. We had, I think it was Ron Dowdle. I really do think that name sounds right, but that might just be me getting confused. Because we had the, we had a linebacker win the Heisman, because he had like 80 sacks on a season. I don't even know what I can. Wait, I guess I can pull up the families. They certainly have had some, some interesting players. Hendricks, get to him. No, all literally three days in the pocket for Cole McDonald, and he somehow just doesn't have a guy open. If you don't, if you don't like highlight or save your vods, uh, they eventually just go away, and I, I forgot to do it before that. Not that they were all that great. So this should be picked off by Berg. No, he's just gonna let the man go right past him. Man, that Rattler series was a lot of fun, but the recruiting, just like ten years to get one season in. Blalick, oh my gosh, literally everybody missing this guy. And he's gonna be. Not in for the touchdown. <laughs> oh no. I'm surprised. First off, we don't tackle the quarterback, and then he just pitched it through our, our corner. We, we don't talk about lo losing or comebacks here because. Because it happens. <laughs> We're up, up 10 with uh, just over a quarter to play. I don't think we could fuck this up. At least uh, unintentionally. That was an interesting return. One more touchdown. Give it to Thompson. Oh, look at that move. He fumbled it. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Oh, Travis, what are you trying to do to me, man? Just lost eight yards for himself in the process, too. Oh, this could be a big one. Travis making it up on the play after with his third 
20 plus yard carry of the season and his second of the day. Did get this play off in time. Oh, yeah, was looking elsewhere. Thompson, decent carry there. Oh man, could you imagine having to practice outside in this fucking temperature? Like the summer camp would just be absolutely atrocious. Medley's gonna lose a few yards there. Really, he only lost a few yards so that Thompson could gain him back, is my thought there. Well, only the wisest decisions for me. Bring Vandermeulen on the short little slant. Third and eight. Vandermeulen, we're just gonna go take the dump off. Give it to Eddie. Some nice passing yards. So, that, that's not great. Thompson, another good carry. And we're looking good. He installed a, a new turf this year that is supposed to mitigate that almost all the way. So like turf temperatures are like 10 or 20 degrees hotter than they would be uh, with a with a traditional field. This is one hell of a backbreaking drive if you're Hawaii. Second and three, three and a half minutes left. We've taken off uh, a lot of time in this quarter alone. And now we've got a first and goal. I, I don't think that we can really screw this up at this point. This could be dangerous. We've never just run a normal speed option. Side, I imagine, and uh, the field goal ties it. Oh no, they wanted a normal. Uh oh, well, this is gonna be a terrible return. <laughs> gonna let that bounce in the end zone. <laughs> oh man. Well, we need a, a couple first doubts here now. <laughs> oh man, Lyra, give me something to, to be happy about. <laughs> oh no. Lyra, oh, look at this. Look at this. Eat him up. <laughs> fucking absolutely brutal. Oh, Ethan Lyra, he's moving right there. One timeout left for Hawaii. Two minutes in the game. <laughs> I'm going to say it again. There's no way that we can fuck this up. No way. That's game, right? I'm pretty sure we can call that as game. <laughs> Second and two. Minute left. I don't want to go into the end zone. Just run into a guy. Keep burning the clock. Last thing I want to do is kick a field goal. Get into the end zone. We'll score the touchdown. <laughs> there is still 30 seconds left. We learned this the other day. We're going to, uh, we want the all the experience we can get. So we're calling a knee here. Oh man, 11 and, one, 11 and two. Take the knee, get the 10 XP for, for kneeling, even though it's on the extra point. Let's let's not find a way to screw this up. Up 9, 36 seconds. There's no way that we could lose, right? They're not going to return this one. So we don't have to worry about that. Um, we've run almost twice as many plays as them for more yards, and yet they are not down by much. Uh, AIDS, our, our one point loss was a terrible 6-6 six six Utah State uh, that I just kind of fucked up. And then the other one was to uh, Alabama. Nice sack there. They, they 
dismantled us in the second half. Oh, second and 22. Conveniently, the 10 second runoff does not exist in this game, so they run into a whole lot of problems, but uh, they get more plays off as they're gonna spike the ball. So they ran the ball, burning a bunch of clock, and then they're now deciding to spike the ball. Let's see if we can't turn this into an interception. I'm gonna bring pressure with Wesley though. I trust everybody on the team more than I trust uh, our line. We still have a, well, you know what? We're gonna take a timeout. I don't know why I needed to take a timeout. We have the ball with one second. You better believe we're throwing a, we're throwing a bomb here towards the end zone. <laughs> I'm looking uh, for somebody. Vincent, can't come down with it. <laughs> Oh, we're so bad at placing passes for our super tall receivers, but we get a win. Uh, kind of felt unlikely for, for a few seconds there, if I'm being honest. Um, yeah, Virginia Tech ends up beating Clemson by two. I'm unable to bring that in. Stanford wins the Pac-12. Uh, Indiana wins the Big Ten. They're going to be top ten. Wall State wins it's the MAC, right? And hey, we at least got Thompson uh, the invite to New York. We got to play Utah here. The Vegas Bowl. We move up to number 17. Oh, Hendricks wins the Bednarik. Okay, we're going to get some trophies here, apparently. Martindale wins the Outland. Martindale wins the Remington. <laughs> Hendricks wins the Linebacker of the Year. <laughs> we're going to go ahead and throw our first thing into the kitchen sink. More easily recruit some better players. Those 50 points a week really add up to getting... The, the few good players who are tall. Look at everything. We know that Virginia Tech is the ACC. The American was Memphis. That's right. Gosh. <laughs> Not a, a lot of parody. 7-3 is the winning conference record. Uh, Texas wins the, the Big 12. Number 5 in the nation. Big 10 is Indiana, of course. 14th. 12-1 on the season. So USA is Army, who was at one point in the top 5. The Mac, Ball State. It's a solid 11 and 2 season. Mountain West is us, of course. I don't know why I need to stop on that. Pac-12 with Stanford. We're playing the fifth best team in the in the Pac-12 apparently. CC Auburn with a perfect 13 to 0. They took out Tennessee in the championship game, and Bama. Very confused season for them uh, as they finished 10 and 2 and a third. The, uh, in the conference. The fun belt is just, it is what it is. <laughs> Texas State, I guess, winning it. Rose Bowl, Stanford, Indiana. <laughs> this is un unlikely. I'm a computer. Okay, the, the rest of the games matter. Fiesta, Texas, Maryland, All State, Florida, Memphis. That should be a really easy game for Florida. Rose Bowl, Clemson, Notre Dame. Kind of expecting Clemson to win that. 10 and 2, Notre Dame. Georgia, Oklahoma in the Cotton Bowl. Both three lost teams, both uh, out of the top 10. Should still be interesting. And the national championship, of course. Auburn, Virginia Tech, both fighting. One of them will have a perfect season. Both currently 13 and 0. Sim through a couple of these. In the Rose Bowl, it was, oh, Stanford just putting the beat down on Indiana. Maryland, Texas in an interesting rematch of previous games. They're in the Fiesta Bowl. It's uh, Texas finally getting a win against the Terps. The Sugar Bowl, we expect Florida to win this. So yeah, they, they do. It was, I think, 45-24 is the score that I saw. Cotton Bowl, I'm going to say probably Georgia wins this. And, oh, <laughs> that's a beatdown. Georgia puts on the Sooners 38-6. There's not even a chance. A couple of field goals probably for Oklahoma. The Orange Bowl between Clemson and Notre Dame. Clemson's probably feeling a little bit let down, so might not show up perfectly in that one. Uh, but maybe they're just pissed off. They get their revenge against a not great, I guess, necessarily Notre Dame team. Ranked one spot ahead of us. They're going to finish 10-3 and three and Clemson 13-1 with a New Year's 6 win in the Natty. 
it's going to be Auburn. 39-27. They finished the perfect season, 14-0. Virginia Tech, the Hokies, their, their dreams aren't going to be realized. But you can't be upset with a 13-1 season. With the way that they've been playing. We've got a game here. I guess I want to see what Herb Street has to say about it. But we've got a game against a 7-5 Utah. Just lost to a now 6-6 six six Utah State. Herbie says they're going to win. We are plus two on the season in our turnover differential. But they, they put up more offense than us. We're through the air. The pass defense is better. This this will be, a, I, I think, a close game. If I don't play like an idiot, I've got a chance. But, of course, that's definitely not a given. They're unranked. We're in the top 20. So one would hope that we could bring that in. I'm just going to go full dark. The dark giraffes here. Going to Vegas. We're going to have a lot of fun. 